Close now. Go back to the structural file. Open with precede. And let's create a join. Joint. Add. I'm gonna call this 9999. Next, it's 1.99. Here we're gonna use 41 meters and the fix. I will restrain all the degrees of freedom. Apply. Close. Zoom to extends. Here it is. Now it's time to create the plane numbers. In number. Add. The group will be called SLG. Let's select the joint A and joint B and then apply. Let's do it again for the other joints. Okay, here it is. Now it's time to define the properties of the these links in property menu member group. It's already here, so you just have to push add. Let's choose the tubular section. I'm gonna change this to centimeters. Here, I'm going to use 15, here, 7, 49. Density, I'm going to use a very small density, it's not that like model. And then apply. Close. Close. Let's see the solid. Here it is. Okay. Oh. This model is stable since there is only one point in can rotate. Okay, uh, so to avoid this, I'm gonna create some sprints. First one, let's go to the joint menu, sprints. Select this joint and use fifty five here next here five. Okay. Here is and save the model. Close it. Now let's create the round file. Go in analysis generator, reset analysis type, select the analysis type, gonna choose static analysis, check environmental loading options, I'm gonna change something here. I'm going to ask for the reactions and and forces. Okay. I'm not asking for the project, okay? So now we can run the analysis. I have to choose the the file. First the model file and now the C state of file. Now we can run.
here's a warning message telling you that you are not doing go check that's okay no problem let's open the file go to the top and search for eastland sorry east spring here you can see for the three low cases in each point the reactions in the springs they are very low, so it's not affecting the model. And here's a summary. Okay. You also can check for the sling loads. I'm gonna search for the group as here it is. It's the member, the joint, and the load cases. Okay. Here's the forces. As you can see, they are very low here. The moments are very low. You can, can use uh, release in the members. So that will be zero, zero, zero in the moments. That's it for the normal. Now let's go back to the folder and copy the three files. Go to 7.5.5. Paste. Let's open the stack heap that, that file and proceed. I'm gonna create another joint. A relative joint can be called 9998. It's two centimeters above 9999. So 999 is the reference joint. And the fixity, I will release just the C translate. Translation. Okay, can apply now. Gonna connect two things to the to this new joint. Okay, go to member, member properties. I'm gonna change here to create and then apply. Call this one. Change rate and apply. Okay, let's zoom in. Here it is the two joints, two things each one. Zoom the extends. Now, in the joint 9998, I will create, I will add a load. Joint load, the name of the joints 9998, load condition 75p, load ID 7p. In z direction, I will use 75% of the total reaction on the other model, and it is 3324.20. And apply. Thank you for this. And check this is correct. ACG is here again. And okay. close it. Good. Can save the model now. Close it. Let's open the C state input file with data gen. I will include the new load here, signs 1.0. Apply. Save. And close now.
and delete this and go to analysis generator. Let's change the folder. Let's update it and use the same analysis using these files inside the folder 7525. Okay, and and run the analysis now. Again, the same warning message, no problem. Let's open it and search again for screen. It is still slow, but a little bit higher, and you can reduce these forces by using smaller stiffness to the springs and but you can use this size just for sure and let's search again for the SLG group here it is and here are all the link forces okay for each Loading and again, it's with the moments you can you can add some release to the members. Not see it then again. It's zero. So that's it. That's the what I wanted to show you. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.